Welcome back to John's Bistro. This is episode five. In the past episodes, John's Bistro has been using differentiation to help the bistro tremendously in moving forward with their plan. Differentiation is the process of breaking down goals for the company into sub rules and having employees with specialized skills carry out those tasks. But along the journey, they faced another road bump. After analyzing the classical decision-making model, they realized there were troubling results. The marketing plans have not reached their expectations. John realized an immediate change needed to be made in order for the restaurant to see another day. He noticed a change occurred. A change can either be caused from an internal or external force. In John's case, it was external and it was right down the street. John and his staff split into subgroups one team for finding out whether the causes were external forces or not, and a second team to see if they were internal forces. When they all met up, they came to the consensus to start with the second step in evaluating change, which is diagnosing problems. Jake and Stacy brought an issue to light. They noticed that a multitude of customers have only been ordering a select few dishes, making other menu items obsolete. Hannah takes on the role of a change agent. A change agent is an individual responsible for implementing change efforts. This force can be external or internal as well, which in our case is internal. In her new role, she suggests that an innovation to the menu and brand image might just be what the bistro needs. John hates to admit it, but he knows Hannah's right. After giving in to Hannah's rebranding concepts, they called for an intervention. An intervention is a set of structured activities or action steps designed to improve an organization. Hannah brought a lot of rebranding concepts to light, including how the menu needed to be renovated because visual appearance can bring in a lot of customers, whether dishes are tasteful or not. The first step in the intervention that they came up with was to find new menu items to appeal to a younger crowd. The younger crowd was the target market. Once they decided on new options, all they had left to do was the rebranding and redesigning steps for the bistro. The new launch plan blew their competition out of the water, and the simplicity of their brand sold them the most.